So my goo, jit, zoo, crew, toy insanity here, and this is Heroes of Goo, Jit, Zoo, Round 8, Round 8, Volume 8, Goo, Jit, Zoo, Series 2, Insane. Today we got Giga Tusk, he's super crunchy, and Red Back, he's super goopy. And I think the gimmick for Series 2, although they don't say Series 2, Moose just, you know, apparently they just want you to think of it as one continuous series. We call it Rolling Stock. But the new feature or gimmick, drop in with this batch of characters, is the Water Blast Attack. The little face will suck up some water and squirt it at the opponent. Very cool. Super crunchy. Gigatusk with his fists of steel, Gigatusk can hammer any barrier. He nails his enemies into the ground with his hard hitting moves. All right. Red Back, he seems to be a spider. A master of entrapment, Red Back strikes quickly with his fang like claws. Few can escape his web of steel once they fall into it. Wow, these are very abbreviated bios. The bios in Series 1 had at least one more sentence, and they were heavy on puns. Moose really phoned it in here. Not nearly as much attention to detail with the copy. Of course, most people don't care. They're going to rip the toy open. They're going to play with it until the dog busts it open. Which is probably fine with the ones that have Orbeez, or water, or even the crunchy stuff. But you know those ones with paint? The ones with <laughs> latex paint inside? Like, uh, who was it? Pantaro? You bust up with Pantaro, you're gonna ruin your carpet. At least. Alright, he's super what? Goopy? Oh he's, got, oh, he's got a bunch of webs. This looks like a slime material and a bunch of plastic soft plastic, you know, rubbery webs inside. It says here, contents, gel, synthetic, rubber. Okay, he's got that synthetic gel red back, and he can, uh, his head's not as squishy as you would think, but apparently he can slurp up some water, <laughs> spit it back out. Red back hero pack. Giga Tusk with the hammer attack. An elephant and a spider. Okay, okay. You stay. Oh, wow. Super crunchy, but these are like. Almost the size of marbles. He's got that nice ASMR crunch. But all the previous crunchy ones, the guy with bones, the guy with teeth, and I think there was one more. They all had tiny pieces. <laughs> These are some substantial boulders. Very weird. Gel and plastic pellets. I think this guy might stand up. Well, I was hopeful. Alright. He's leaning on red back, but he's standing. Says here. I already read this. Okay, but let's see who else is coming out. Thrash is back. Blazagon is back. Pantaro is back. And then we're also going to get Reptar and the Ultra Rare Hydra. So, one, two, three new figures, one, two, three returning figures, and the seventh figure 
is the Super Ultra Rare. I never found the Super Ultra Rare from Series 1. Someone should probably send it to me. <laughs> Alright, Redback, are you ready for that Super Crunchy attack? Yeah, I think it's not just the cold weather. I think uh, most water suck things you would expect a softer rubbery plastic. All right. Oh, he's hit him in the back. Tag me in red back, I'll give you the assist. Oh, that hammer is vicious. I can't believe they gave the dude a hammer. He's got claws. I don't know. Who won? Who's next? You decide. Also, I didn't... Hey, hey! Stop looking down my drawers. I didn't notice or point out that... Wait, can his head actually move? Check it. That guy's head is articulated. No, it's, it's intentional. So it popped off so easily. Because, look, it's not actually glued on. They do have articulated heads this series. And drawers. Separate piece of plastic drawers. That's that's an improvement. Where is the little logo? The logo is molded into the plastic on the drawers. Remember one of my main complaints with the Series 1? It was the paint apps. The paint apps, you play with these one time. And the paint starts peeling off the super rubbery, stretchy plastic. So they had painted on drawers, painted on clothing, other paint apps on like their claws and stuff. And then the logo was painted on. And the logo always rubbed off. But check it. So you can remove their heads to get a nice water suck. Put the head back on, I guess. Or, as I said, it just allows them to be articulated. So not just more gimmicks in Series 2, I think actual improvements. Still, they should be able to stand, they should all be able to stand up on their own with their heads. I'm Toy Insanity, Heroes of Goo Jitsu. Check out my Goo Jitsu playlist. Thumbs it up for your daily dose of toys. Bye-bye.